We're here at Red Rocks and we're doing a photo shoot with EV Builder's Guide. We've got the race car, we've got Dave's pickup truck, and Carl's Porsche that we're doing some filming with. So how long did it take you to, to finish this from when you started? Just under two years. Okay. And you pretty much did it all yourself, right? Yeah. Just you and me. <laughs> you, you on text. <laughs> yeah, Carl asked a bunch of questions. I was able to help him get the answers. And yeah, I can already tell it's just got plenty of power right there. Nice quick steering. Yeah, it's so smooth. I just love the power delivery and it's no lag, no delay. So on your road trip, you drove it up here from Taos. You said you did over 120 miles per charge. Yeah, the first charge was 120 and it went about 60% for that charge and that's going over some mountain passes and stuff. Mm -hmm. So not too bad then and then. About averaged out with the drive, especially at the speed and everything, about 40 miles per 20% of charge. Okay. Yeah, that makes it easy to calculate. Yeah. And that's highway driving too, so yeah. in town you can go further. I get, yeah, I can definitely do better in town. I've done as much as 50 miles on 20%. Stab the throttle a little bit. <laughs> Man, it's just, it's all the power right there. Yep. <laughs> That's too fun. That feels like the weight balance is really good too. Yeah, it worked out with the better suspension and the right spring rates and things. It definitely helped a lot. A little clear road. You want to film out the front? Yep. Yeah. How's it going? Yeah, I really like the steering feel. It's a sports car. The handling is great. Yeah. Um, got that uh, controller that kind of runs the electric uh, hydraulic pump okay. based on speed of the uh, motor. Yep. It really helps a lot. I gotta build a, a sports car. It needs to happen. It fits like the personality of the car, the motor, everything is just, it's like it's designed for it. It's a nice combination, not too much power. Yeah. But enough. Let's see, do you think we can spin the tires a little bit? You can try. No, nope, just dead nope, hook. A little bit. A little squeak. A little squeak. The great part is it's so quiet that nobody knows you're driving fast. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I have surprised a few people. <laughs> it's been kind of fun too. A lot of people recognize the car, but when they saw me plugged in, uh, 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 at the charger the other day, I was like, couldn't believe it was electric. He's like, yeah, it's electric. Oh man, the torque. <laughs> this car never had that much torque, even the turbo ones. Gotta go electric. Yep. Well, thanks for letting me drive it, Carl. Oh this my is gosh, yeah. 
treat, man. Let's, this is where it's at. Electric sports car conversion. This is the, the goal. When, uh, you get the German high voltage. Right. <laughs> That's funny. The battery. So this is the front battery, is this about half of the total? About, it's uh, four of the medium sized cells and four of the small. Okay, yeah, so about half. Yep, and then the larger cells are in the back where the back seat was. And he's got the eye booster, the electronic the brake booster, yep. and electric power steering pump. Right, from Inductive Auto Works they have the, the control for it to work off of the uh, speed of the RPM of the motor. That's right, yep. So, Nice rust-free car, yep. and then the rear battery is underneath this carpet here. You can see the yeah. safety disconnect here in the yep. box there. Yeah, so there's a, basically the box. So it's great. You still have all the cargo capacity now. Pretty much, yeah. I guess you lost the rear seats, but that's okay. Yeah, who's gonna fit in that? Yeah, yep. nobody's gonna sit back there anyway. So yeah, if you're Everett in Taos, New Mexico, you might see Carl driving around in his electric Porsche. Yeah. Thanks for showing it off. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for the help on doing it. No problem.